Hi, this is Kim with Floor Express. Thanks so much for taking the time to look at my samples. These are samples for week 45, which will be November 4th. Hope you're enjoying this beautiful fall weather. Anyhow, we'll look at some one gallon samples. This is a Super Tunia Royal Velvet. Those are looking real nice and full. This is a Lobelia. This is a proven winner. This is Laguna White. It is a young crop, but they are rooted. Um, and they're looking really good. A bloom from a begonia, there you go. Um, in the four inch, we have a couple things. We have some different petunias in the dreams. This is the Piketty, and we have the Janie Yellow Marigolds. Um, as far as mums go, one gallon. We do have a few colors left. This is about how they are in the bloom cycle. There are some fresh blooms that haven't opened, so they're not totally spent or anything. You'll get um, some time out of them, some good shelf life. We just wanted to show you that. As far as Gerber daisies go, we have lots of different Gerbers. This is the Royal Prince Neon Violet. It's got lots of buds on it. Looking nice. Jasmine Venom, a one gallon. We do have some Crown of Thorns. We have a Pink Cadillac and the Yellow Denny. Some Geraniums that are looking good. This is Pink Splash. And then in the Pentas, this is a Graffiti White. We have our Anne Marie. Nice and full. This is the Kufia Flora Glory that I've been telling you about. This is the Diana Magenta. It's got that really bright bloom. They stay nice and compact. Orange Halo Gallardia. They have buds all set there, ready to go. Um, this is a Sun Patient Red. And we also have New Guineas. We have red and white, several colors in those. Um, begonias. We have the bottom blooms. They've got bud set all on them, just starting to open. Um, let me come around here real quick. Our zinnia, this is the Dreamland Red. You can see all the buds set on there, starting to open up. And this is the Dianthus Dash Crimson, really dark red. The Alyssum, the Giga White Alyssum is looking really good and full. We've got Dwarf Ruelia with color. Um, and this is a Lucky Star Violet Penta. And in the one gallons, there's some other things. We have violas that, you, you know, if you're interested and you need violas, we have that as well. But I'm gonna go on to, oh, strawberries too. We have strawberries, a new crop right here in the front. As far as Mondo grass go, a little thin, our dwarf Mondo on the small side and on the dwarf, you can, I mean, the regular Mondo, you can see, you can see soil there. So unless you need them for a job, you know, you might want to try to find those somewhere else. Um, as far as hibiscus go, we do have some of the Hollywoods. This one's called Wild Child. It's got nice buds all set. The Lime Sizzler Firebush is super nice for the fall. Red Sensation Cordyline, these are really great for your pots. Aztec, we have Aztec on special right now. So give me a call if you're needing Liriope Aztec. We're just long on them, they're super nice. Um, let's see. On the Proven Winners, we have one of their Oh So Easy Roses. I believe this is Paprika. And they're looking really good, especially this time of the year with all the rain we've had. We've got Trinettes. Trinettes are looking nice. Um, we've got a crop of Podocarpus. They're full, but they're not real tall. Let's come over here. Let's see, this is the, I think this is at last. This is the At Last Rose, another Proven Winner Rose. Some of you have had that in your garden center or in their jobs over this past year, and you really like that, so we do have that again. Tacoma Stands, those are nice. They have buds set, some bloom. We've got a nice VO. Those are looking really good. Um, also, Xanadu. Xanadus are looking nice, full. Miami Supremes in the front, Jack Frost. Our crops of, of the foxtail fern are looking nice. I look shilling or full. Here's your dwarf burfidae. And then this is, I believe, a lavender formosa. And then we have our little John bottle brush. Now these are just a few items that are on the availability. 
If there's anything that you're not seeing here and you need pictures of that's on our avail, just give me a call. I'll be glad to get that for you. If there's anything I can do for you,